come sit by me. Again, can you make out what he's saying to us? Watch that doorway. It's down below. I can see. Holy! I don't know what he said. You guys are gonna have to hear that. Well, now that we're reacting to their voices. This is when they get really excited. This is when they get really amped up. So after they speak, you know that they're in here. You can hear right now me talking to you. They're not talking right now because I'm not asking them questions. Will you? Whoa! The same voice comes through again and says, I'm Otto. Will you? Will you? Whoa! I'm communicating with a spirit at the Dumas brothel, but that's not the only activity we're stirring up. That was insane. Is she okay? It was like she's a lightning been... bolt. No, she's acting weird. It looked like a lightning bolt. It looked like a lightning bolt in this chair. It was like something trying to manifest. Why is she just staring at the camera? I don't know. These girls are starting to zone out. Look, see? She's jumpy. They're starting to feel the, the energy in the rooms. The guys back at Nerve Center see a very strange light anomaly manifest in the chair next to Caitlin. They radio me to quickly go in there with the SLS camera to see if something will appear where this anomaly was just captured. McKinley is in full panic mode as I inform her that she will have to remain down here a little longer by herself. I'm sorry, I'm just freaked out. It's okay. Ten minutes. Stay still, okay? Okay. Are you on the bed with her? Are you in this room with her? How are you feeling? It's so cold. So cold? Mm -hmm. Are you shaking? Yeah. Okay, I can see you shaking. That could be a spirit touching you. And I'm just trying to see the spirit. If there's a Whoa, 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 whoa. Billy, come here and look yeah, at this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, there it is. Look, look, on the bed. On the bed right next oh to her. Oh my her. God. It's right oh next to her. Oh my God. I'm so cold. There's a spirit right next to you Right next to you where you said your arm was That's the side cold. that's like the coldest. Yeah, there is. Oh my God, I'm getting the worst goosebumps right now. It's on what the she is feeling is being documented on the Kinect camera. We are completely blown away because we are seeing an unknown figure in the same area where the anomaly appeared only moments ago in this chair. We are documenting scientific evidence of this spirit dropping the temperature around Caitlin and even touching her arm. Can you touch her arm again? Touch her arm. 
boom, just yep. touch it's, your it's, arm. It's got its hand on you right now. It's touching your arm yeah, right now. Goosebumps on my arm right now. It's yep. got its arm just like out and just like stuck right on your here? arm. Yeah, right there. Yeah. Yep. Oh, as soon as you touched it, he went away. Wow. As soon as you touched, it, he went away, and he's gone. Oh my god. That was awesome. We were watching you. We could tell that something you kept looking over your shoulder and yeah, like something, something was like right here. Yeah, that's where it was. That's exactly where that's it was. That's where it was. And we saw the anomaly right here in this chair. Was it when I like was looking at my arm? Yeah, yes. when you were yeah, when you were looking at your arm. Yes. And at one point it even reached out and touched your arm and it just stayed like that. I now call for all of the ladies to come into this room to see if I can document further proof of this spirit's presence. You feel that? There's really cold right here. Yeah. Oh my gosh, right here. Oh my arm is really cold right now. What are you guys feeling? Cold air right here. It's right here. It's really cold. There's one on my hand and my right elbow. This is where it was touching as all four of the ladies continue to feel this spirit that keeps touching Caitlin, I document an unexplained five degree temperature drop directly where they are feeling this spirit. As we release the ladies from our investigation, it seems as though this angers the spirits because Billy immediately has a disturbing experience up in the attic. We're getting ready for the transition to begin our investigation. And Billy was upstairs up top, setting up a thermal imaging camera. I was down here rearranging nerve center. And then that's when you started screaming for us. You know what's weird? I just tripped out. When I walked from there to there, I was like, I didn't realize where I was just now. Really? Yeah, I feel really lightheaded right now. My head's buzzing, Jay. I didn't know where I was just now. That's weird. Whoa. Right. Yeah, yeah. Are you okay, Billy? Yeah, it was. Just, it's just a strange thing. It's a time slip, literally. Like 10, 10 seconds worth of time was lost. Who's up there? Look, I don't like what you did to my neck. Ginny said that you don't like me. You haven't even met me. I haven't done anything wrong to you, so if you don't like me, then it's time to show me why you don't like me. I hear that you're attacking people in here. Even women. If there are multiple spirits here, I'm only talking to the one older man that seems to be aggressive and violent. Do you hear my voice? 